So here we have the Toyota Yaris on a 10 plate. I'm going to start off by showing you around the outside of the car and then we'll hop in and run through some controls on the inside. From the outside though, you can see it's a five door car with alloy wheels. Let's start off inside the boot and work our way around the rest of it from there. As we approach the back of the car, you can see we have reversing sensors, plenty of boot space as well, along with that 60-40 split folding rear seat should you wish to increase this space even further. Okay, so we're just gonna work our way back around to the front of the car and then we'll hop in and run through some of the controls from there. Just briefly before we climb in, I think it's well worth seeing the interior from this exterior point of view. There's plenty to run through on the dashboard, so let's hop in and we'll do that now. Okay, now that we're inside the car, we're gonna start with the dials. On the left-hand side, first of all, we have the rev counter, we have the speedometer in the middle, and over on the right-hand side, the fuel gauge and the total mass for the car, which were 119,576. If we back out to the steering wheel next, uh, we have uh, stereo controls over on this left-hand side. The main stereo itself can then be found over in the center just here. So we have the uh, volume for the stereo, of course, there. We have a CD player. We've got our radio. So you can switch here between the various different uh, wave bands. Um, and of course, you can seek for individual stations and then save them as favorites along here as well below that we've got the air conditioning so you can adjust first of all the fan speed you can determine whether or not you're recirculating the air that's in the car or bringing in fresh air from outside of it down here you then decide on the direction the air is being distributed in and whether or not you have the air conditioning off which is the case now or on again and then down the bottom here we have the temperature selector and our heated rear screen we have a six-speed manual gearbox for the car. And then down the bottom in the middle here, we have an auxiliary input, so you can listen to your own music via the auxiliary input as well as the CD player. And we can turn off the stop and start from here as well. All that leaves me to say is thank you for taking the time to watch this video. If you'd like to come and see the car in person and have a test drive, please feel free to give us a call here at Surrey Specialist Cars. We'd love to hear from you soon.